Welcome to Artmind. Today we are learning the pencil tool in Photoshop. The pencil tool is located in the brush tool stack and like the rest of them, its shortcut is also P. It's similar to the brush tool. You can increase or decrease the pencil size with the brackets on the keyboard. So this is me increasing the pencil size with the right square bracket and this is me decreasing the pencil tool with the left square bracket. Like the brush tool, we can draw with the pencil tool. So here's a click and drag and here's a stroke. And if we press and hold shift, we get straight lines. Or we can also click from one point to another by holding shift. The pencil tool shares exactly the same options as that of the brush tool. So I'm not going to discuss them again today. You can check my brush tool tutorial for that. Instead, I'm going to start with auto erase. I'm going to begin by checking auto erase. Here we have a normal stroke, no problem. But then as I go ahead and draw on top of the paint, watch what happens. We get this white color. But why is that? That's because white is our background color. If it were green, we would have gotten green or any other color for that matter. So let's go and try this again. I'm going to draw on the yellow paint again and see if it turns white. It does. But what if I start drawing away from the yellow paint? Now it draws with the yellow color of the foreground color. But if we click on the yellow and draw, we get the background white. But what happens when we draw on the white? Nothing, it's just using the normal foreground yellow. The white color activates only when we paint on the normal foreground yellow color. But if I deactivate auto erase, all the going back and forth will stop at once. So this is our normal stroke with the foreground color. I'm going to try and draw on top of it to see if we get white. We don't. And of course, if we click away from the yellow color and then draw, we get the normal yellow. So it is always the foreground yellow wherever I draw. One thing in which the pencil tool is distinctly different from the brush tool is that the pencil tool can never be soft. You can get the pencil hardness option from here or you can right click on the document. You can see that the hardness option is at its max which is 100%. I'm gonna use that. So this is our stroke. Let's right click again and reduce that to zero. But it's still hard. So this is all I have for today. Make sure to check the other videos. I'll see you next time. Bye.